I feel with all my heart that we are moving into a season of separation. God is separating the, the sheep from the goats and a goat will eat anything and a goat will follow anything. But God is raising up the remnant. I believe that right now we're moving into a season where God is raising up the voices that have been hidden, what I call the cave dwellers, the ones that he's been waiting that will stand up and make a stand and not give a rip about what anybody thinks anymore. God is raising up the ones that have been forgotten about. And you're never going to get anointed till you get forgotten, by the way. And, and the greater the anointing, the greater the isolation. And so I am learning right now that God is raising up those that have been hidden. Because we're about to see an army and I can see them in the spirit walking out of caves and suddenly realizing this is their moment. That's what I believe God's doing right now. What's happening here in D.C. is probably one of the greatest things I've ever seen. Because it was birthed out of Dr. Rodney Howard Brown catching a vision from the Lord, but it's bigger than him. The Lord has used him throughout history as a catalyst to moves of God. God has used him over and over and over, whether it was in the 90s or whatever. This thing that is happening in D.C. is so much bigger than anybody can imagine. You're going to begin to, we're going to begin to hear of reports of congressmen and senators falling on their knees in their office weeping yeah. for no reason. We're going to begin to hear of people that work in the administration of the president suddenly having to take a stand for conviction and they're going to lose their jobs. Because what is happening is God is beginning to restore. I believe this with all my heart. I stood in the middle of the Capitol today. I believe that God says, I'm taking back my nation for one last move of the spirit. One last outpouring before he comes back. The thing that's happening, the move of God here at Celebrate America is so big and so powerful. And people, you need to understand, this is a move of God that uh, the world has never seen. And it's starting here, but it's going to spread to other capitals and other nations. I feel like it will break out in other nations and other moves of God. D.C. will be saved. I believe that.